So in this video, we are going to customize our app bar and we are going to add a drop down here, some icons here and a drawer here. Okay, so for this, we have to navigate to the scaffold and app bar. Inside the app bar, write actions and in the actions, uh, square bracket, press enter and write icon button. In the icon button, you can specify which icon to be uh, inside a button. Uh, we are going to write icon and then icon, icons dot and press control space. We are going to select settings, but there are many other options, okay? Settings and press enter. So if I save this right here and press control S, you can see a small icon here on top. Uh, so if you want to add a on press event you can write on press and then in the on press we have to write uh, some commands but for now we are going to keep it simple and we want to write something in the console open settings page and don't forget the statement terminator at the end save this file and this file is saved application is updated and press control back tick to open the debug console clear everything from here and press this settings icon you see we have this uh, settings page uh, open setting page here uh, in the console and we can also add more buttons in the app bar just copy and paste this here down below press enter control V to paste and we are going to name it profile and open profile page the icon is going to be uh, user okay save this file and we have two icons here on the top okay and if I open the terminal again and clear everything this will print open profile page and this icon will print open settings page in my next videos we will learn how to navigate to these pages but for now that's okay all right so uh, what if we want to add a drop down here for this we have to make a class and at the top here um, anywhere you can make a class this is my class uh, which has a title and an icon okay and then we have to add some options in the drop downs these are some options which we are going to show in the drop down here and here uh, in, in our app bar where we added two buttons we have to add a pop over button for pop over choices okay you can delete this on select and then control save this here we can see all the options we added okay so let me review this we we just created a class which looks pretty simple and with some options here okay and then down below in our app bar we added two button icons we can just delete this for now or we can comment these and save this to make it look simple and here we have a pop menu button which have many choices and we are skipping first two we can remove this and we can show all the options available save this file and then open, click here you will see all the options here okay what if we want to add a drawer here okay so this is very simple in the scaffold you can write drawer and write d r a w e r drawer okay just save this file and you will be able to see a draw drawer here which is empty because we have not added anything in the drawer which is a separate topic we will cover in our next videos but for now you have just added a drawer you can also open this drawer by swiping from here okay if you have any problem with this code just comment down below this video and i'll help you guys thank you for watching this videos keep making great applications see you next time